Hey guys, welcome back for another vlog, and I cannot keep <laughs> I cannot keep count of these because there's so many. Um, so today was extremely long. It is Saturday right now, and maybe uh, like Sunday or Monday when you're seeing this, or whatever day of the week you're seeing this, then that's what you're seeing it on. Anyways, uh, today I went to a Lego store, but. Uh, they didn't necessarily have boxes, you know, how they usually get the boxes of stuff. They didn't, it was a Saturday, so it was really crowded. So I wasn't really able to describe to them very well without them actually, it was so packed in the Lego store that they couldn't even hear me because of all the screaming kids. It's ridiculous. But, uh, I only got one box. Um, but, uh, I did get like, 17, 18 cups, the large cups that are like 15 bucks each. I got like 17 of those. I spent like good $390, I think it came out to the total bean. And, uh, yeah. And you see this, guys? See my messy handwriting and everything? This, this is the future of Lego Boy. No, I'm just kidding. This, this is actually, um, this is just tells me, me and my scribble, 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 scrabble, scrabble writing. That just tells me um, what the future figures and how much they, sh how much they cost and how much the profit will be. Future figures should cost. So I was getting some ideas. For example, like this machine gun. This is gonna be like an idea I'm probably gonna use. Maybe like this barrack wall. So, I've got some stuff coming, and it's going to be pretty cool. It's going to be badass. Um, oh, oh, let me show you the picture. Uh, that That's all the um, pick-a-brick cups, and I'm about to upload this picture to Flickr. And that's the box, and then I got six gray base plates, Brick Journal Magazine, and Life for George, which is the thing for the iPhone. I thought that'd be sweet to have an iPhone. And then that Lego minifigures thing's just... They're being the non anonymous. So, yeah. And um, I want you guys to check out my site. I have a, um, or at least it should be on there. It may not be up there yet. Uh, I have an M1 Abrams tank, and it's by Brian's Bricks, which is a friend of mine from Flickr. I also met him in real life, Brick Fair. Uh, it, it, it's for sale. There's only three made. It's a giant M1 Abrams tank. It's like the modern combat military tank a lot of people, a lot of the U.S. Army uses. And I think, yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, it's going for like 200 bucks. I know it sounds pretty insane, but um, it's worth it. You should check it out. You'll see, what I, see why it's 200 bucks. But uh, you don't have to buy it or anything. I'm just saying, take a look at it. If you have the money, <laughs> always welcome to get one. But it's an exclusive, only three are made. So maybe a good Christmas gift. Sorry, my my fingers are touching the iPhone screen, so it's focusing in and out. But uh, yeah, that's that's what I did today. Also, um, I'm going to be busy tomorrow, so I actually had to go to church today. But uh, yeah... Oh, uh, some high quality uh, 2012 set pictures were released. The kind of, they were like the ones I showed in my new Lego Boy fan video, but just without the, the weird lettering in the middle, if anybody caught that. Um, but these pick a brick cups, this, this is a sign, guys. This is a sign to something big is coming. And I mean big. Bigger than the Battle of Naboo. Whatever. Get, get near. Alright, well, thanks for watching this vlog, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Toodaloo.